The Festival International de Jazz de Montreal English, Montreal International Jazz Festival is an annual jazz festival held in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. The Montreal Jazz Fest holds the 2004 Guinness World Record as the world's largest jazz festival. Every year it features roughly 3,000 artists from 30-odd countries, more than 650 concerts including 450 free outdoor performances, and welcomes over 2 million visitors of whom are tourists as well as 300 accredited journalists. The festival takes place at 20 different stages, which include free outdoor stages and indoor concert halls. A major part of the city's downtown core is closed to traffic for 10 days, as free outdoor shows are open to the public and held on many stages at the same time, from noon until midnight. The festival's big event concerts typically draw between 100,000 and 150,000 people and can occasionally exceed 200,000. Shows are held in a wide variety of venues, from relatively small jazz clubs to the large concert halls of Place des Arts. Some of the outdoor shows are held on the cordoned off streets, while others are in terraced parks. <laughs> History Rue Dudu Boisel founded the Rising Sun Festijazz, Montreal's first blues and jazz festival in 1978. There were also other previous jazz festivals in Montreal, including the three-day Jazz de Chez News Festival in 1979, created by Montreal bassist Charles Biddle. The Montreal Jazz Festival later, Montreal International Jazz Festival was conceived by Alain Samard, who had spent much of the 1970s working with Productions Cosmos bringing artists such as Chuck Berry, Dave Brubeck, Chick Corea, Bo Diddley, John Lee Hooker, Muddy Waters, and others to Montreal to perform. In 1977, Samard teamed up with André Menard and Dennis McCann to form an agency named Spectra Scene now known as L'Equipe Spectra, with the idea of creating a summer festival in Montreal that would bring a number of artists together at the same time, they planned their first festival for the summer of 1979. Unable to secure sufficient funding, their plans were scuttled, but they still were able to produce two nights of shows at Théâtre Street Denis featuring Keith Jarrett and Pat Metheny. In 1980, a Montreal jazz festival was staged, with funding from Alain de Grosbois of CBC Stereo and Radio Quebec. With Gary Burton, Ray Charles, Chick Corea, and Vic Vogel on the bill, and an attendance of 12,000, the event was deemed a success and has continued to grow since then. In 2000, the festival teamed up with Distribution Select to release its four CD box set called Over 20 Years of Music Plus de 20 ANS de Musique. The box includes a 13 page booklet with the artist's biographies and complete liner notes about the music. In 1999, a group of Montreal jazz musicians disenchanted with the Montreal International Jazz Festival's lack of support for and showcasing of Montreal jazz musicians created an alternative festival called the Off Festival of Jazz in Montreal. The alternative festival continues as an annual, week long jazz festival in Montreal, programmed largely by musicians. Topic recordings A number of albums have been recorded live at the festival, including, Live at Montreal International Jazz Festival, New Air 1983, Live at the Montreal Jazz Festival 1985 Ahmad Jamal 1985, After the Morning, John Hicks 1992, Live at the Montreal Jazz Festival, Diana Krall 2004, Live from the Montreal International Jazz Festival, Ben Harper and Relentless 7 2010, The Montreal Tapes, Charlie Hayden The Montreal Tapes, Tribute to Joe Henderson, Verve, 1989, 2004, The Montreal Tapes, with Jerry Allen and Paul Modian, Verve, 1989, 1997, The Montreal Tapes, with Don Cherry and Ed Blackwell, Verve, 1989, 1994, The Montreal Tapes, with Gonzalo Rubalcaba and Paul Modian, Verve, 1989, 1997, The Montreal Tapes, with Paul Blay and Paul Modian, Verve, 1989, 1994, The Montreal Tapes, Liberation Music Orchestra, Verve, 1989. 1997. Concours de jazz Established in 1982, the Concours de jazz is an annual competition held at the Montreal International Jazz Festival. The competition takes place between Canadian groups performing original music, and is part of the festival's outdoor program. Throughout its history the prize has been awarded to many of Canada's most prominent jazz musicians. Name changes 1982–1986 Concours de Jazz 
1987 to 1992 Prix de Jazz Alcan 1993 to 1999 Prix de Jazz du Maurier 2000 to 2009 Grand Prix de Jazz General Motors 2012 present TD Grand Jazz Award sponsored by Toronto Dominion Bank TD Bank winners 1982 Michel Donato 1983 Quartz 1984 Lorraine Desmarais Trio 1985 Francois Barassa 1986 John Ballantine Trio 1987 Hugh Fraser Quintet 1988 Edmonton Jazz Ensemble 1989 Fifth Avenue 1990 Creatures of Habit 1991 Steve Amiral Trio 1992 James Gelfand Trio 1993 Chelsea Bridge 1994 Norman Gilbolt Ensemble 1995 Jean-François Gruel Trio 1996 Roy Patterson Quartet 1997 Joel Miller Quintet 1998 John Stetch Trio 1999 Chris Mitchell Quintet 2000 Eduardo Pittman Quartet 2001 Nick Alley and Cruzau 2002 – Andrew Downing and the Great Uncles of the Revolution 2003 – Nancy Walker 2004 – Odd Jazz Group 2005 – Alex Belgard Quartet 2006 – David Virel's Quintet 2007 – Felix Stussy and Give Me Five 2008 – Arden Arapian 2009 – Amanda Tosoff Quartet 2010 – Park X Trio 2011 – Alexander Cote Quintet 2012 – Robbie Botos 2013 – Hutchinson Andrew Trio 2014 – Pram Trio 2015 – Rachel Terrian Quintet 2016 – Brad Cheeseman Group 2017 – Alison O Quartet <laughs>